These tomatoes sure are red, aren't they? They're the wild tomatoes. What are they? Solanum pimpinellifolium. I've grown them again. From seed, of course. They came up from seed. Oh, they were dropped last year. So bright red. Beautifully red. Lovely. Nice on a sandwich. So bright. Brilliant. Brilliant. So red. So many of them. All bite size, of course. So many. Lots. We pick them every day. Every evening we pick a big bowl full. So brilliant, aren't they? Brilliant. So red. It'd be nice with salad dressing and uh, sweet potato leaves. That'd be nice on a sandwich, wouldn't it? They have been called currant tomatoes. They are really, only some of them are very small and only the size of a currant, really. Some of them are, are only current sized. Look at those little ones. A bit bigger than a black currant though, aren't they? Or a grape currant. Smile for the camera. Go on. Such a brilliant red. So the idea seems to be to just let some rot on the ground and some will come up. Aren't they wonderful? So red is delicious and they've got, uh, they're sweet with a strong tang in them. They're not like those uh, tomatoes you buy in the supermarket that are, uh, taste like crunchy like an apple. They're not like those at all. They aren't. And the whole shrub, what, it's taller than I am and it's sort of trained up some, uh, some netting. So they are lovely, They're very worthwhile. You could make a necklace out of those, couldn't you? Beautiful, brilliant beads. Gorgeous. So there's the bush. And it's quite tall. Taller than I am. And of course some people pinch the tops out, don't they? I don't do that, we don't do that sort of gardening. Some people do all those religious things like pinch the tops out. So I've got my arm outstretched now. So we didn't pinch the tops out. Some people do all that sort of thing. Most people would. We're well, not most people, of course. This is just a wild garden, really. Look, some are especially tiny, aren't they? Certainly I like currants current tomatoes. So see you, see you again, see you next time.